It was no ordinary PE lesson for students at Gladesmoor Community School in Tottenham on Friday. What's up, man? What's up? What are you talking about, man? Yeah. As some sporting mega star power from across the Atlantic dropped in for a special masterclass. I got this, I got this, I got this. Yeah. I, want, I want the whole place okay, to stop. I want you to scream it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, want you to scream, I want you to scream it. So everybody put their hands in. Attack on three! One, two, two three! Attack! Attack! There we go. Okay. Several American football players out to teach and inspire kids as they learn more about NFL. <laughs> American football is growing in popularity now on the UK side of the Atlantic. <laughs> If their aim was to leave a positive impression of American football, well, you can certainly see that their strategy was very effective. This was the glittering reaction when one of the players allowed one of the students to try on his Rolex watch. <laughs> the players from multiple teams across the US are on their player passport tour designed to establish a connection between players and new fans in the UK as well as Germany, another NFL popularity hotspot. Stop saying that. I can't do it. Yes, you can. hit the camera. Forget the camera, it's his fault. Ofe Abada, a Nigerian-born Londoner who hails from Brixton, is the physical embodiment of just how popular NFL is and how far it's growing outside of America's borders. Uh, it's definitely growing. Like in, in the US, it's, it's, the, it's a religion. Everyone has their own ties to it, whether it be um, high school, college, or the NFL. Um, you know, there's just a lot of history there. Um, but, you know, myself being, being a Brit, being Nigerian born and being able to go over there, it's extremely important to be able to come back here, use my platform, use the stage that I've been, I've been afforded to be able to expose the, the, cult, the, you know, the kids, the culture, the, this country to that game. Oliver, if you had one question to ask FA here, what would you like to ask? Um, how many people have stopped you in the street? How many people have stopped me in the how street? How many people have stopped you in the street thinking, thinking that, uh, uh, thinking that, knowing that you play NFL football? Um, in the UK, it's definitely the, the numbers sure. increasing. It's, it's, it's small, but, but it's increasing. In the US, more, more people than it's, it's definitely more people in the US. The overall visit was part of HR Sports Academy, who managed these external sport lessons in schools, which in turn was part of the Laureus Sport for Goods Model City London initiative. Laureus Sport for Goods, and they support organisations around the world and really zoning into that, how sports can really develop um, social or promote social change. You can see with the kids out here, uh, they ask a lot of questions about players and they know a lot of players in the NFL, so it's pretty cool. Uh, obviously, football is the most popular sport in America, but you're starting to see when you come overseas how popular this sport is uh, across the water. And obviously, we're playing games here. Tennessee Titans were actually coming here in October to play. Um, so I think it's just good to be able to get into the community, you know, and see the children, see just see everybody to kind of keep promoting this sport because it's such a great sport. The UK and Germany come in at second and first, respectively, as NFL markets in Europe. It's estimated that the UK alone has almost 3.2 million avid fans of the sport. And while it might have a long way to go before it's as popular as European football, you know, the stuff that you kick with your foot, if today is anything to judge by, it's certainly got its fans. I definitely consider becoming a coach or being in the NFL because this experience was great and I'd love meeting new people and everything. It inspired me to go to the NFL. Like, I really wanted to get a scout today and I think that was going to happen. I made a great first impression and I realised you can, you can never make a second impression on these guys because like, what happened is they were like, what they see is what they, they remember. remember. They, they remember, remember it. it. Who would be your team then? Not your English football team, but oh, your yeah. NFL Raiders, team. Raiders, Raiders, Raiders. I even got a hat. Yeah. Yeah. Simon Anderson, London Live.